Welcome to a special edition of Two Finger Spirits. We've got a lot of stuff going on today, don't we, Camera Guy? Oh my God, so much stuff so going much on. So much going on. Let's talk about the tequila first. So we've got, because I'm a nice friend and I don't drink tequila, but he's turning me on to it. The Camera Shy Camera Guy is a tequila lover. And he took this 1800 silver and we put it in a old bourbon barrel. This is day four. It's more of a bourbon bottle. Bottle, sorry, thank you. And we added these, can we focus in on that? We added one of those spiral chard number three things that he got off of Amazon to it. And this is day four. Look at the color change in four days. They say you can do it up to two weeks. He's trying to get it to look like uh, the Anejo. The Anejo. What'd you call me? That's exactly what I said. Oh, so we're going to try to see how that changes it from the silver distillant to the other thing we're gonna see how close we can get to that we're getting there four days and then we're gonna taste it we're gonna see what we think as far as how it changes the flavor and we profile. did a video on putting that in there and we're gonna do a couple videos on the way there so look out for that one and then we got these barrels unlimited barrels oak, limited oak barrels limited <laughs> Which, I don't know how limited they are. I think they have a few in stock. Yeah, well, they do. Well, you well, know, I have to say, though, they did upgrade me for free because one of them was not in stock. I'll put the description in, in the description. I'll put the website too, in yeah, case anyone yeah. wants to get one. Because so far, they've been decent. Because I've heard other people say that they're corks for their bunghole. That's what they're called. For LOL. Some jokes. Is uh, cracked and stuff. So our, our bunghole is nice and clean. So good. <laughs> and look at our custom engraving. So we like that. So what we're going to do is we got the Buffalo Trace White Dog Weeded Mash Bill. Hold on, before you go any farther, let me mention that we did fill both of those up with water yeah. because I, well, we followed all the de directions oh, to protocol. it. Protocol. Yeah, protocol. Is that what it is? Protocol. Whiskey protocols to make sure there was no leaks. And it worked out really well. They're, they're not leaking anymore. And what we're going to do, Brandon, tell us about we're, the White we're Dog. We're going to add this Buffalo Trace White Dog. White dog. We got the Weeded, weeded Whiskey Mash Bill. Let's try it. We got to try it yeah, first. We'll taste a little bit of it. Um, and we're going to put it in there for, we're, we haven't decided how long we're going to do it for. Our hope is to uh, get something close to Look Pappy. Look at that color. We're going to try to get something close to a Pappy. Ew. Ew? Ew, it smells awful. Yes, uh, our buddy James, who's been in a few of our videos, and, and Pete tried this one. And, and they said the same thing you're saying, but... Yeah. I don't oh think, my God. Really? It's a, it's one fourteen proof. I definitely get the wheat on the nose. Oh, that's all you get is wheat on the nose. It tastes like burning wheat. You know, this is what the frontier. I like it. Oh, awful. Really awful. James and Pete said the same thing. I mean, it's not aged at all. This is what the pioneers were drinking. This is moonshine. Yeah, well, you know what? I'm not a pioneer. Mm, well, I am. They're much cooler than me. Wow. I don't mind that dry, sweetie. So we're going to add this and see what happens. We don't know how long we're going to do it for. We haven't researched it. Both these barrels are between what, a three and a four char? Between a three and four char, the one Brandon's pouring into right now is a one liter. One liter. Which really is a .75. Really, they get the one liter from its displacement. Uh, volume and they say that the smaller the barrel is the more surface area to liquid there is right. which makes the aging Ages process quicker. very mm -hmm. quick so there is a chart out there i want to say and don't quote me it's, it's around 53 days to one year uh, equals one year yeah i think that's what the research i read kind of indicated as well yeah, give or take a day or so or a lot of days but uh so you know we're gonna we haven't decided how long we're gonna keep it in there for but we'll see yeah we're gonna try to. We get also take suggestions. So honestly, it's it's a fun experiment and all about enjoying and having fun. So it's okay if we mess it all up. Yes, but if anybody knows anything about this and they want to share some of their insight, please. We're we're up to uh, we're up to listening to. I'll tell you what though, this is awful by itself. I didn't I didn't think so. Oh, but James, you, Pete, all say the same thing. If anyone did have had like some straight up moonshine, this has got the kick of it. I mean, it's not too dissimilar from, it's vodka, it's weeded vodka for essentially, right? 
I guess. I'll tell you what though, if you compare a silver tequila to an Aneo tequila, like all those wood, oh, yeah. all, like it brings out so much flavor. It really tells you how important the aging process oh, yeah. is. So if you don't understand how important it is, pull, pick up a uh, 1800 silver or any type of silver tequila and compare it to the Aneo of the same brand. So this so could get, probably use a little bit more. We'll get another bottle. Because I think I got like to fill it up all the way. Definitely. But uh, yeah, stay tuned to see what happens next. Is there anything I didn't cover? I think that's everything. Is there Was there a specific reason that we talked about why we chose the weeded mash bill? Well, because I believe that that's the closest to the Pappy. I think that's the mash bill that Pappy Van Winkle, Rip Van Winkle uses. Um, but I don't know what proof they come out in. in. So this is 114 going in. I don't know if we got to get a, a, a proof of meter. Yeah, a so proof meter. Because I don't know. I think it, it, it may uh, go up in proof by sitting in a barrel. The angel share comes right. out. And, and we uh, might add water. So, you know, there's still a lot of research, but from what I understand, we have some time to figure it out. We got some time. So, uh, you know, stay tuned. We'll keep you posted. And if you know anything about it, you got any ideas, share them with us. We, we'd love to hear from you. Yeah, we're learning. We're just having fun. Cheers, Thanks everybody. For coming. Cheers.